I, um, we are a nonprofit organization, so it's to my knowledge that we're actually entitled to five minutes instead of three. Yeah, am I correct on that? And you're speaking on behalf of the organization. Yes. I, and on the card, it does say Oscar Grant Foundation because it asks the question, what organization are you from? So the Oscar Grant Foundation is on both cards, and so I'm speaking on behalf of the Oscar Grant Foundation. That is correct. So we can adjust my time accordingly. So anyhow, you know, it's real important that you feel the community and what's happening. You know, and I'm not going to belittle those that are not of color that's sitting on the council, but it's important that you recognize and everybody here, take a look at the people that's on the council. We have elected them. They are elected officials. And if they fail to do and perform their duty for the community, we need to make sure that they are not reelected. And let's keep that in mind because we do have the power in this community. And believe this, this is just a small portion of the people in the community that are speaking to this issue. Amen. But we got young men of color that are fearing for their lives. And I would hate to see another young man die in these streets because he want to pull a trigger to protect himself. So we need to take that in consideration. And what's happening with the temperament of our young men in our community? I am very passionate about this because my nephew lost his life at the hand of a rogue police officer. And the way it looks, in the last five, not even last five months, but the last three months, seven police shootings Five fatalities? We need to address this issue very soon and quickly. I mean, because we're talking about a danger. We got, we got smoke smoking right now. You know, and so we're here because we hate seeing our children die in these streets. Understand, this is one of the most important factors that you have going on in this beautiful city of Vallejo. I mean, you got sister cities across the country, but you don't want Vallejo's city name to be tainted for its failure to do what its responsibility is, and that is to take care of the citizens of this community. It appears to me, and I'm sure many others, when an investigation takes place, that these killings that are taking place are retaliatory. There was a police officer that was killed here in this city, and since that killing, there's been shootings by police officers that has been happening on a regular basis too consistently. But please feel me and hear me, and much love to you, my mayor. You know, it's my hope that you represent the city of Vallejo as a brother, have you, like you have been doing. Much respect to you. But here's an opportunity for us to rise above and take care of real business, and that is to take care of this community. Amen. Uh -huh.